Hey guys, Random the Craft Scissors here with another plan with me. This one is in my Erin Condren and we're doing the week of October 9th through October 15th and I'm using this Beauty Babe kit um, in honor of my mom's birthday. Her favorite color is purple. She's not huge into like glamour and stuff but she does like to get her nails done and um, she always likes to put her lipstick on and stuff like that but um, she's I wouldn't consider my mom like where she like wears a ton of makeup, if that makes sense. So her birthday is the 11th. Um, we're probably gonna celebrate it on the 15th though because my dad, like the way he works. So this is the kit from Pomegranate Sticker Co. You can use RWCS25 for 25% off. She also does mini kits too for you white spacers. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna call that. So I'm gonna pull these clips. I did the gold because of like the gold accents everywhere. So there's a gold heart. This also comes in pink glitter in my shop and then it just has a white background. And then I did this lipstick has a new release this last weekend just because I knew I was going to be doing this kit so I wanted to make sure I had a lipstick so this is matte glitter this is more chunky glitter and then the back is just a matte cardstock it doesn't have any glitter on it at all so I don't know what's going on that noise is I think the dishwasher or washing machine I don't know okay and then the washi I grabbed was this one this is from my friend um, planner love SP Sarah so I'm gonna be using that maybe at the bottom I don't know because she also has this too so I think that'll work well. The washing machine just started back up again, I don't know. And then this um, was from my friend, Susan. Pretty sure Susan got me this, like around my birthday. So this is from Simply Gilded. So I'm excited to use this. Cause it basically has everything that's like in this kit. Like it's perfect for this. Love it. Okay, so those are the ones I grabbed. I also thought if I needed skinny, not this one, but I would use this one. They're from um, the Planner Society box. I thought I would use the little pinky purple I don't know I think that's my dishwasher or my washing machine sorry I don't know if it started back up I thought I hit pause all right let's go ahead and do the headers first because that's where we stopped all right so let's see I do to do little things and today so to do and and little things, a oh, little bit. She has those little bits. So that's cute. Little bits. And today, so this is my Etsy planner. So if you have an Etsy shop, I suggest you get some kind of a planner, especially if you need to start doing like a new releases schedule or writing down what you're doing every day. Um, I find it really helpful to like look at and. Um, like, it helps me remember to post on Instagram, like, all of that kind of stuff. Yeah, I think it's, like, draining the bin or something in the washing machine. Whatever. Um, so today was interesting. Um, we celebrated my dad's birthday, and he wanted to go to Famous Dave's, and so we did. And then it turns out he wanted to go there because they put, like, a firework in your ice cream, like, when it's your birthday. <laughs> and he knew that would be really entertaining for my son, who's four. So I always say that, like, his age and stuff because... Maybe you're new to my channel. So if you are, welcome. <laughs> I saw, I basically tell funny stories as I plan. Oh, that's really frustrating. Okay. Um, so that was fun. And then we, which I saw a student working there. It was really funny. I can't go anywhere in my town without like seeing a student. It was so funny. So she was a hostess. And then um, we left and we went to the academy because my husband wanted to look at hunting boots. And... Of course, I ran into another student there. <laughs> Actually, two. One worked there, and then one was there. So I ran into two more students, which is fun. It's just, that's the way my life goes. Some days, it's like I don't run into anyone. But if I'm on, like, their side of town, like, where I live is not their side of town. But it's hard to explain. So <laughs> um, then we left Academy, and we are going to stop at the store on our way home and get a few things. Not a full grocery shopping trip, because we didn't really, like, meal plan in time. To like do a full grocery shopping trip but there was stuff that we were out of that we knew we needed for tomorrow um i grabbed that today so i guess we'll start down here so we're in the we're in the truck and we're driving on the highway to get like to where we need to go and all of a sudden i feel like a pinching on the inside of my upper thigh and i look down and there's a bumblebee right down there stinging me i couldn't believe it you guys i couldn't believe it like i'm wearing jeans it was so funny because when I told one of my friends, she was like, so we were you wearing a dress or shorts? And I was like, no. So I don't even know how it got in there because we were going 60 miles an hour. I don't know if it got in there like when I got in like at 
academy, like, when I got into the truck, if it, like, landed on me and I, like, sat with it, I don't know. But it, like, I just knocked some washi over. Whatever. Um, not the one I'm using, so that's the important part. <laughs> and I was just like, ow, ow, ow. And my husband's like, what's wrong? And I was like, it's a bee, it's a bee. And so, like, then it kind of fell onto my leg and, like, stayed there. I guess the poor thing was in shock, too. I don't know. And the poor thing, it stung me, and I still feel bad for it. What kind of person am I? <laughs> <laughs> so I stick my foot out the window on the highway to knock it out. Thank God I didn't lose my shoe because I was wearing my Birkenstocks and those are expensive. They're old, but they were expensive. So I was glad I didn't lose it. But the bee finally got off my leg and went out the window. And then I'm sitting there like in pain and my husband's like, okay, I guess we're going straight home instead of the store. And I was like, no, no, we have to go to the store. And I was like, plus if we go to the store, then I can go to the bathroom and get the stinger out. Because I think it's still in there and I don't know. <laughs> so <laughs> I talk really fast and I'm upset. So... <laughs> We get in there, I go to the bathroom. Um, there's no stinger. I don't know where it went, but I was good there. And, like, I could see where it stung me. And I was just like, oh, my God. This is crooked and it's bothering me. Um, and so we go ahead and do the shopping. He's like, do you want to just go sit in the truck? And I was like, no, because you might forget something. And we ended up, so we left the store. I get home, and it's still getting, like, worse and worse. And I probably should have put, like, Benadryl on something on it. But I put Neosporin on it. I'm not even sure why I did that. And then, like, I had some friends telling me about, like, this baking soda thing. And I was like, well, the stinger is definitely not there. And it's just really swollen and red right now. And my husband's like, it's probably going to be worse tomorrow. And I'm like, well, I hope not because I kind of need to be able to walk and move around my classroom and not tell everyone I have a bee sting on the inside of my upper thigh. I mean, I'm telling all of you. But, you know, <laughs> it is what it is. But I was like, oh, my God. It hurts so bad. <laughs> And so I'm wondering if it's going to be worse tomorrow morning. Because, okay, the last time, let's let's have a little bit of story time on background on bee stings for me. So the first time I ever got stung, it was in sixth grade, and we were running our laps around the baseball field, and it got in my sock, like, from the grass or something. And the stinger, I remember seeing it, like, in my sock. And so then the nurse, like, called my parents, and I ended up going home because I was like, my mom's here, I want to go home. <laughs> <laughs> That's what that was. <laughs> I probably could have been just fine with an ice pack. So I iced it, the one that I have now. Anyway, so that was the first time I ever got stung. And then the next time I ever got stung by anything was when Wash flew up my shorts on a camping trip, which is why I don't camp. And I still get stung. Goodness. But that's a long time because I was 12 and now I was like 11 probably actually. I was 11 and now I'm 30 and I'm just now getting stung by my next bee. So that's a pretty good gap actually in my opinion. Okay, so I like to use these and then I cover up what that says because I just like the little flags and the like wide it out space. Anyhow, okay, so this one we do full box, checklist, half box. Full box, then checklist. Here's the other full boxes. And then half boxes. Oh, she has date covers. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So there's a couple different checklists. I might go... I might use these instead of using the full box. Because then I can use those again in like a mini plan with me. I don't know. We'll see. I'm trying to be more white spacey to see if you guys like that. <laughs> we'll see. Okay, so too glam to give a damn. That's going to be my quote of the week, which is funny because my mom would never say that. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even, I'm laughing because I'm imagining my mother saying it. So, <laughs> so look at this. Patani and I don't have to worry about covering up our letters. And she can cover up her dots. <laughs> and we can all be happy. <laughs> so funny. Patani and I talk about, I have to cover up the dots. And she's like, I have to be able to see all the letters. <laughs> so that's our thing. <laughs> We're weird like that. <laughs> Alright, so I definitely want this one because it has like all the makeup. So I want that in there. I think the washing machine started back up. I paused it and I think it started back up all on its own. Or someone came in and started it back up. I don't know. Either way, I can hear it. Ow. My bee sting is hurting. Okay. <laughs> ah. Anyhow, so when I got stung by wasps, they actually flew out my shorts and I couldn't like sit to pee for like a week. So at least it's not that bad. <laughs> I think. We'll see about tomorrow. But I don't film tomorrow. Tomorrow's Monday. I don't film on Mondays. I film on um, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Tuesday. <laughs> Pretty much, unless something else comes up. I like these lashes. Someone had washi with lashes on it. Who was that? Someone did. I think it might have been the butterfly planner. I think I watched her. And I think she gave some away to another girl that I watch. 
Uh, I watch and I'm picking up a watch. Ah, irony. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's not really irony. So <laughs> it's like when people say that it's coincidence. Not irony. But there you go. Okay, here's some heels, which I would never wear. I don't wear heels. I'm a flats kind of girl. How about you guys? Do you rock the heels or rock the flats? I want to know. There's mascara. Okay, so what's your best mascara? Ooh, we can just talk about makeup. I think I'm done talking about my bee sting and still starts hurting again. So, <laughs> um, I've tried Better Than Sex mascara, and it wasn't waterproof, the one that I had, so I didn't feel like it was that great. Um, I do like, oh, there's Marcel. I kind of like that one. Some mascaras have too much of, like, a smell, and I can, like, smell it while it's on my eye. I'm weird. Which is why in like my Ipsy videos, which I don't have Ipsy anymore, but in the Ipsy videos that I had, I definitely like smelled everything in my boxes. I bet you can totally hear my washing machine. It's so annoying. All right, so let's do the checklist. Oh wait, I wasn't gonna use these. I was gonna use these because then I thought I could include some more washi. That was my plan. Okay, so I think I'm gonna put this uh, this right here. Actually, no, I want to use this one because yeah. I remember why now. This is not working for me. Oh, and this is not a special X-Acto knife. I covered it in washi tape. It's not, you can't buy this. You can just buy one and cover it in your own washi tape. <laughs> I cover things in washi tape all the time. <laughs> um, light plate switches. Um, my monitors. My desk. <laughs> washi tape can go on everything. <laughs> in case you didn't know. I also use it a lot in card making. Because it's easy. Like whenever there's an animal on, like, where does this start? Um, if there's an animal on the front of the card, I usually use grass washi. Like they're sitting in the grass. 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 <laughs> Goodness. Okay. Um, okay. What about, about lipstick? Um, I tried Mellow. That's good. Um, Benefit. I like the color Committed, I think. And, um... I do have a couple of the Kylie's. I want it from another YouTuber. Um, I think her name is Janae. I don't remember now. Oops, it was a long time ago. There you go. So I'm putting that there. I might put some more at the top. I don't know. I might have to trim it though if I do that. Well, not if I like sneak it in there and then put the headers down. It's just so pretty. I want to use it. <laughs> I'm using it. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna go all the way to the top of this. I'm gonna try to stick it down. Let's see how I do. Oh, I did pretty good. A little crooked over there. There. I just kind of use my finger to guide me. Guide me. Okay. Mm, tear it off. Simply gilded washi is so nice, but it's pretty pricey. Not gonna lie. If you're like, oh, she recommends this. I'm going to go get it. Yeah, well, it's expensive. <laughs> Just to let you know. Okay. Trying to line it up. Trying to line it up. Now it's as good as it's going to get. There's going to be a little bit of a gap, but that's okay. Because I'm going to do date covers too, so you're really not going to be able to see this. And I'm so glad there's date covers because I hate Columbus Day. But I think you guys have heard me say that enough. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, now I want to do my date covers. I changed my mind. I know I was going to do checklists and then I changed my mind. <laughs> okay, so here's Monday. See, it like covers that up a little bit, but like you can still see. Like you can still read gorgeous and lipstick and stuff, so I still like it. What is the background on these? I don't know. Clouds? I'm trying to see. It's whatever this is. I don't know what that is. Okay. I don't know, maybe it's eyeshadow or makeup smudges. I'm not really sure. Um, my foundation, I like the Fit Me foundation. It's at Walmart and it's like $6 a bottle and I get amazing coverage out of it and it lasts me all day and I can't afford anything more. <laughs> um, I have tried CoverGirl something else like true color or something like that and that didn't work for me because I'm pretty pale and it was like it's always a shade too dark and if I get the white then I'm completely washed out and I was like okay I'm not that white without makeup but 
I don't want makeup that washes me out, but I don't want makeup that like just tans my face. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I'm being a little silly. So tomorrow is Monday. Not a lot of things going on. I'm probably going to stop at the store because I'm not about to pay our grocery store prices for kitty litter. Um, no. Okay, I want to shorten the checklist because I'm not going to be able to write here anyhow. So we're going to shorten it. Alright, so this is how I do this. I kind of line it up and I don't mind if this hangs over. But I don't want to have the extra heart. So I need to cut off two hearts. Two hearts. Just because I wanted my washi right there. <laughs> totally worth it. <laughs> to go through cutting these. <laughs> I don't care. But I thought, oh, I think you guys liked it when I did the like checklist like this instead of the full box checklist. Because it does like give me some more white space. So I just need to cut all these off. Hopefully I don't mess it up. Because <laughs> I don't have a backup for my checklist. Well, I guess I do the full boxes. If I mess these up. I like the shorter. Because honestly, this is my like Instagram box where I write down like what clip I posted on Instagram that day. And I don't really want to post that many times. Like I don't know any I don't know how many times I post. I mean I post like PR stuff throughout the day too, but and honestly most of my stuff ends up either first thing in the morning or in the evening when it's like Monday through Friday because I'm working. Occasionally I'm able to like post during the day if I find my lunch. And like sometimes I can log into like the Wi-Fi at my work, but like sometimes it doesn't come up right. So like it doesn't give me a sign-in button and then I can't sign in. It's weird. Like, I'm allowed to be on the Wi-Fi, but it just doesn't come up sometimes. That's weird. So when it does, then I can be posting a little bit on my lunch break. and Yeah, so that's good. If I'm waiting on my copies and I got nothing else to do but sit there. <laughs> Wait for the copy machine to jam and then I unjam it because I pretty much have to babysit it. I really wish we could just have a copy machine where we put stuff in and we leave and we can go get stuff done and then we can come back. But then there's also a problem of, like, people taking your stuff in the copy room. And that's an issue because they just grab their stack and they don't see that like someone else's stuff is in that stack and then your stuff is gone and you don't know where it is so you either wait for it to come back or if you needed it right away you just print it all over again which is so wasteful but it's like well I need this and that person took it and I don't know who it was because it's copy room that the entire floor shares and sometimes people from downstairs come up and use it so who knows I don't I don't know okay my mom um, really likes Mary Kay. She is not a Mary Kay consultant, but well, like my aunt was at one point. Anyway, um, but she likes Mary Kay, and I remember like saving up my money and calling her Mary Kay lady and ordering from her, for her for her like birthdays and Mother's Day and stuff. I remember doing that when I was younger, and um, so she really likes Mary Kay products. I think all of her lipsticks and eyeshadows and mascara are probably all Mary Kay. Even her perfume is Mary Kay. <laughs> so she just loves it. So that's my mom. Alright, so I think I'm going to use the skinny bow washi at the top and then I'll use the lipstick at the bottom. No, maybe I don't even need to. I wonder if the lipstick at the bottom will be enough. I mean, it'll be two wide washies down here, but that's okay. I don't care. I was like, this is the perfect spread for lipstick. Yes, yes. I need to have this. They're all different, like, bottles. It's funny, though, because they're all, like, red or pink. That's pretty much all I wear. Okay, so I'm going to go down a little bit and try to have the bottle sitting on the bottom line. Because there's a little bit of white space between there and there. Not that anybody would notice. I don't know if you would or not on where I said it. Um, what else about my mom? Uh, I said her favorite color is purple. She does not wear high heels, but she has. I've seen her wear high heels to, like, functions. I remember the most glammed up I've ever seen my mom was when my dad used to work for the Christian music industry, and she got to go to some kind of Christian music awards. The Dev Awards. And, God, my mom looked like a Barbie doll that night. It was amazing. I mean, my mom's always amazing, but, like, I just remember going, wow, like, that's my mom. I don't know. She'll probably think I'm being silly, but she watches these sometimes <laughs> when she has a minute. <laughs> okay, so some of these are not 
full full so that's what I was kind of worried about is these this size but I think it'll be okay to have a little bit of space around it so I'm not gonna use the bow washi because if I grab this one I'm pretty sure it fills it up if I go like this it goes too high so I need to put it under the header and then it's yeah it's perfect so this is perfect for this size but then it's a little bit short for this size so that's why I was like well I want to change it I'll just put these kind of in the center there I don't think it looks that bad I think it looks good okay then I want this pink one so I was watching um, playing with me's which I like sometimes I just don't feel like I have time to do or I don't like remember I guess because there's times where I'm like why didn't I watch that I'm like mm -hmm. I was watching something else probably on Netflix because that's what I watch Oh, I finished um, Sherlock Holmes on Netflix, by the way, in case you want to talk about that. <laughs> so, um, I loved it. I hope there's more seasons coming. My husband says there's not, and I'm like, what? I think it was only like three seasons. But it was like, I think it was the British one. They're really long episodes. They're like an hour and a half. But I loved it, and I'm, gonna, I'm really sad that it's like not going to keep going. So, if it's over... But I think he's already on another show. And then I know the same guy played Doctor Strange. So I know he's been busy with that too. Okay. I think I did pretty good matching colors a little. Except for in this one. Because <laughs> it's purple and that's pink. Oh, that's crooked. <laughs> purple and pink and crooked. <laughs> it's not a good mix. <laughs> it's because I didn't lay down the sticker correctly. I laid it down like I did that one. I need to bump it up against the top. That's how I knew it was crooked. I knew it. I knew it. Okay, so I end up with one checklist, these little flags, and quarter boxes, and then one, like, smaller half box is what I'm going to call those. Okay, and then bottom washi. How cute is this? Floral. It's so pretty. I think it's a good contrast from the one that I put down, so I don't think it'll look like double washi, because those almost look like stickers. Because they're lipsticks. If this was like super floral pattern and then I put this one down, then I think it would look bad, but I think it looks okay. It's a nice contrast. What else? Okay, so Wednesday is going to be probably my worst day this week because we do this CARES day at my school and we go out into the community and the kids all work stuff. And why you guys think that? Probably going to think I'm a terrible person. But anyway, I don't get to be in my classroom, and I lose my prep period, and I'm stuck on a bus all day, and so I don't, that's not my favorite day of the year. I think it's important for students to do outreach, and I like it, but it's just, I wish it was on a Friday, <laughs> not in the middle of the week. <laughs> but whatever, I don't have a decision in that. That is above my pay grade. Okay, so the 10th, no 9th, 9, 10, 11, is that right? I think that's right. This should be the 15th. Yeah, okay. So 15, she has little date dots, so I'm gonna stick those down real quick here. 14. Okay, so I can't talk about what I got my mom for her birthday because she might watch this. Um, I still need to make her card, I haven't done that yet. I did give my dad the hooray card from the um, box paper pumpkin box out you guys saw me put together the hooray card if you watch the card making videos <laughs> some of you may be only here for the plan with me and that's okay <laughs> i don't expect you to watch all my videos <laughs> that'll be a lot <laughs> okay and if you do thanks <laughs> uh but i did that and i have to i need to work on a card for my mom i don't i think there was more in that box i think there's two more cards but I'm not sure if they were birthday related, so we'll see. But I need to make them anyhow, so maybe I'll do a video on that. There is some deco here, so we'll add that at the end. And it looks like there's a planner too, but I think she has a planner. Yeah, she has a little planner here with the girl. Which, I feel like I've seen that girl on this kit before. Somewhere else, but I don't remember where. Alright, anyway, header is back. Okay, so I like to use a uh, This Week sticker. Is that right? Yeah, uh, this week, goals and Instagram. This week, I don't think she has a goals one. No, so I make my own. Okay, so I'm gonna do it this week. And this is clips I plan on making this week. And I'm gonna go ahead and put down 
one of these, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah, she always includes an extra one. So I'm gonna use this for my sidebar. There is a Monday through Sunday on this kit, but that's like meal planning and I'm not, no, I can't tell like what I'm gonna make. This is a list of clips that I'm gonna try to make this week. Sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't. I've been talking about the loot clip and I just can't get, wrap my head around like how I want it to look. So I'm sorry the loot clip has not been available yet because I just haven't figured it out yet. Okay, so goals. Um, I'm gonna put a, the little heart label. I'll do a little heart one. Oh, washi. Ooh, which washi am I gonna use? Ooh, I don't know yet. She has some in the kit too. Hold on. Yeah, we'll use hers. Let's use some of this. So there's some eyelash or doilies or gold square or kind of rainbow looking. Let's use the rainbow looking one. Where's that one? Okay, I like to just space out my list, I guess. Okay, and then grab this back. That's my goals. It usually just says like sales, revenue, orders. And I use a half box for that. I'm gonna go back. I'll use this one. That's perfect. And then we'll use some more washi. Use this one. And then I put habit tracker. Okay, let's put some more of that washi because I need some more filler space to fill up my sidebar. And she doesn't put spaces in between her washi strips, so you can block them together. And it won't look funny. I feel like it's kind of crooked. Like the whole thing. I wonder if I can move them all at the same time. Yep, I did it. <laughs> Not sure if that was the best way to do it. There you go. Okay, here's my habit tracker that she has in her kit. And then... I need to fill it with some more washi. I think I'll do the eyelashes one. That'll be kind of fun. Because it'll look like another half box or shit anyway. By the time I'm done, because they match up, so I love it. I think I already said that. Whatever. <laughs> okay, so about the live plan with me. Um, people have asked me about that because I was supposed to go live somewhere else, but I'm not. So, um... The problem is, like, right now, I'm filming at, like, 11.30 at night. Like, I need to be in bed right now. And I'm afraid that, one, it'll go too long. And because, like, I'm going to be asking, answering, answering questions and, like, talking to you guys and stuff. And so I feel like it will go too long. And I also don't know who would stay up this late with me. <laughs> so I don't know. <laughs> That's my, like, quandary, I guess. It's kind of like... I don't plan during the middle of the day or in like a reasonable evening time because I have to wait till my kid goes to bed and I get all my Etsy stuff done and then I can film. So that's going to go down there. And then she has the little flags. So I'm going to put those up here, which I like because it kind of ties in the washi from the bottom. I don't think it covers up too much of Sunday. Sometimes I put those down before I put that on and I'm like, mm, I kind of like seeing the flag. So. I'm just gonna put it on there anyway. There's that one. And then, let's see. As far as stuff I pre plan, I'm looking at my previous planners. Um, just like spread picks, and yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna get my little camera. That's gonna go over here because it's for my Instagram posts. I can write Instagram. This is a paper mate gel. It writes great. This is going to be goals. God, my laundry has been going this entire time. I'm sorry. Oh, I just wrote YouTube. Like, I'm going to put YouTube. No, that's not what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be sales. Orders. And revenue. That's funny. Okay, and then that's clips I'm going to be making this week. So that's like me working on the computer and stuff. So I'll put this here. And then, um, payday, you never know on Etsy, like this far in advance, like depends on when your sales are. And plan with me, I plan in this planner. 
on Sundays, so I'll put that there. And then I need to pull my cameras out, I think. Um, I go ahead and put, I dump my trash in my office on Wednesdays because trash day is Thursdays. So that goes in this planner too. I don't think there's anything else really that like applies. Yeah, I don't think so. Okay, so I'll put that to the side. And then new releases go up on Thursday, so I like to put this down. I'll put the little computer down for new releases. I never know what time, just in the evening sometime. So new releases. And then... Um, I think that's it from the kit of the deco. So I need to get my functionals out from the back. Nope, they're in the pocket. They're in the pocket that I'm currently in, like the week of. I forgot to get those out ahead of time. Usually I do. This week I'm using, or last week was the grease kit. So that was fun. I need to finish that up. Okay, those are done. Alright, so I have my Fry Yay sticker from Britannia. I'll put that down on Friday. And then I have my Happy Monday sticker from Sticker Monster Co. That's Jacqueline, if you're like wondering which one she is. So I'm gonna put this to the side. I don't wanna cover up the makeup stuff. I know eventually I'm probably gonna have to because I'm gonna do something tomorrow for the shop. Not tomorrow, next week. <laughs> Okay, then my character sticker in this planner is Britannia Nicole's Penguin. So, they're always there. And then, what else? Don't know what payday's gonna be. Already got my planner sticker. Already did that, did that, did that, did that, did that. Done, 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 done. Okay, so those are all just ones I use throughout the week. Like. I'm really funny. I put this when like I get, I don't get sales, <laughs> and then I put this when I do. <laughs> so it's just kind of corny. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> it's fun. It's an easy way to look at like days that I've gotten orders and days that I haven't. Honestly. Okay, so let's go ahead and add in this deco here, which you know I'm gonna put here because I don't really need like I just write the clip name of like what I posted, so it doesn't really need like a bunch of space in my opinion. So I'm just gonna put these along the bottom. I'll just add those in. I didn't want to put these next to those because it's the same thing. <laughs> okay, I'm going to stack these here. Oh, that's a little crooked. Oh well. It's a tiny sticker. What do you want from me? And then there's a little phone. We can put that over here. And then there's a planner. Oh, that's kind of funny. And then we'll put that over there. There's a coffee cup. And there's a watch. I don't have a fancy watch anymore. I mean, I do. I have, a, I guess, a guess watch. I don't know. It was fancy when I was in high school. <laughs> do you guys think my guess watch is fancy? <laughs> Why do I say things? This is like a cute little planer charm and like poof ball tassel. That's cute. I'm going to put it this direction though. And then I realize these have some blank boxes, so I should put that in there. There's some bobby pins that you're probably not even going to be able to see, but they're there. And then I, I save these back because, like, sometimes I want the date dots for something else. Um, and I think that's all I have left of that one. That's all I have left of this one. I'm not going to add in those flags because it will take up too much room. And then I have this one. I only use one sticker off that one, so I can definitely do a personal plan with me. And it can almost be more, like, about the florals than about the glam. So that's different. And then the washi and the quarter boxes, which I might use those throughout the week to write on these. So you'll see those pop up a little bit. And then the functionals. I don't think there's really anything that I need to do for Etsy with these because I was trying to think. I don't think so. Not for Etsy. I like this little makeup. That's cute. Okay. So I think that's it for that. And I already wrote in that I'm doing new releases, so we can put in the clip. Um, so some ideas that I'm throwing around for next week. I can't write in this one. It's in the previous one. Um, I'm going to do a pink and gold rose, I think. And then there was something else that I was going to do. I forget. I don't know. That's one of them that I'm thinking about because it goes with another spread that I'm doing. Usually I look at like what spreads I'm going to do next week, and I try to make clips to match it. 
<laughs> so there you go. <laughs> All right, so there's my little lipstick and my little gold heart. I think it looks really cute. I think the gold definitely is picked up. This is like rose gold. I don't know if you guys can see, but that's like more of a rose gold. But I still think it's, it goes. So there you go. Thanks for watching. Give it a like and please subscribe. And make sure you check out the shops below because there's discounts for Pomegranate Sticker Co., Britannia Nicole, Sticker Monster Co. Um, I did show you these from Cupcakes and Stickies. I didn't use them. And then there's coupon to my shop too. They range anywhere from like 15 to 25% off. So make sure you check those out. Bye guys.